But first, how about those UTSA Roadrunners locked in to play a championship game? Now April and Sierra leading a push to get more students into the game for free. But as Eyewitness News reporter Sarah Duran explains, it's catching her some heat. Loud cheers from April and Sierra and her family as UTSA clinched a last second victory and division title over the weekend. I mean, the almost blew the dome off the top of the building. It was incredible. An experience so incredible she wants other fans to enjoy. So in order to do that, we need to get those students in and we need to get them in for free. We don't want any barriers to attendance. And Sierra wants to pack the dome on December 3rd. That's when the Roadrunners will play their first ever championship game. Labeled a Conference USA game, students will have to pay to attend. I immediately put a Twitter post out on Sunday. Uh, companies started flocking, how can I help? She put up $5,000 worth of tickets, then more donations followed. HEB came in with 2,000 tickets. Mayor Ron Nuremberg has also made a generous donation. To date, the pot is overflowing with more than $40,000 of donations. There is more to come. Now, while April's doing a lot to pack the dome here, her critics wonder if she's doing enough. Some have gone online to vocalize their opinions. It is so well worth it to have those people attack me knowing that we're going to have the dome packed. She'll deal with the haters later. For now, she's focused on the mission ahead. Now look at the excitement it's really generated and everybody wants to be a part of something big. Like packing the dome, cheering on the runners for the big game. Sarah Duran, Ken's 5 Eyewitness News.